Rocket and Groot are two of my all-time favourite Marvel characters. I think they're absolutely adorable. So when I discovered the animated short series on Disney Plus from 2017, I thought I'd give the first episode a go. This is Dream Machine and Rocket and Groot are flying their ship. Things go wrong and they crash land in the Broker's Junkyard. And they're hunting for scraps that they can use to repair the ship and Rocket happens to glance over and find what they consider well what rocket considers to be their dream ship and they now then face the dilemma of shall they buy the ship it's very brief it's about two minutes in length if that and my favorite thing about this is just the constant i am groot having groot saying that over and over again i'll be honest it's not as funny as i thought it was going to be because groot and rocket are hilarious. Whenever I watch Guardians of the Galaxy, I absolutely love them. And I just find them that I find their dynamic to be amazing. Their camaraderie is fantastic. I love the way Rocket talks to Groot. And we do kind of get some of that attitude here with Rocket that I thought worked very well. The animation style itself is quite pleasing, but it's not as cute as the actual Rocket and Groot. They don't look as good. And I guess that's kind of a given. Had I not seen Guardians of the Galaxy or had Rocket and Groot not existed outside of this animation, I probably would have been wondering what on earth was going on, to be honest. I don't think this is something you'll get much out of if you are not a fan of Rocket and Groot or if you haven't seen Guardians of the Galaxy. And I feel like on its own, it just doesn't stand up. I think you need the original source material and be able to relate to them as a friendship unit to be able to enjoy this. So it wasn't as good as I thought it was. When I first saw the series, I thought, fantastic, a new series I can binge watch. But after watching this first episode, I'm not saying I won't watch any more of it, but I'm not as excited about it as I thought that I was going to, that I thought I was going to be. It's, you know, it's relatively interesting. Rocket's dialogue is interesting. Groot's is, I am Groot. Um, vocal performance is fine. The quality is the animation and the editing. Absolutely no problems. It's just, it does really pale in comparison to the actual Rock and Groot. And I wasn't expecting anything quite as amazing as that, but I feel like it's actually quite a significant drop in quality. If you're a fan of Rock and Groot, definitely check it out. But if you're not all that bothered about them, I don't think this is one you'll get much out of. 